I be so sick of you niggas, y'all don't do this to you I be so bold with myself, girl, you come and fuck me I feel so ordinary, step when you won't round me Treat me like all the right, play me out Arguments, you can air me out Trip about your whereabouts, I can't keep no conflict with you What can we just bother? Life without you been feeling kind of strange Well, I see that you're doing very well Ha, you looking very well I miss the way your perfume smell I miss the way that you blowed up my line Just to make sure that I'm feeling well Welcome back to my channel, I am Keisha Jabri And today I'm going to be showing you guys how I install and style this hair from Ash Mary Hair So thank you guys so much for sponsoring this video I'm in love with this unit and how it came out So if you guys want to see how, just keep watching But before we can get into it, y'all already know that y'all need to throw this video up and also comment down below and let me know what you guys want to see next. And also subscribe to my channel because my cash baby's lit. I'm lit and if you subscribe to you lit too. And that's on what? That's on period. All the links on this hair will be listed in my description box as well as the coupon code. So do not forget to go down there. But let's just go ahead and hop right into this video. This is the unit that we're going to be putting on today. I'm so excited because this is one of my favorite colors on myself. I just feel like browns and like... I don't know, like warm browns and like chocolate browns. They just fit me so well. So I'm so excited to try this out. And this hair is from Ashmary Hair. So I will have everything listed in my description box, of course. But let's go ahead and try this bad boy on. As y'all can see, I've already done my um, wig cap method. Nothing too major. If you want to see how I do this, I'll have another video linked. Um, but let's just try this thing on. Let's see what it's given. Okay, okay, we can work with this. As y'all can see, the lace is super duper light. I believe this is transparent lace, but that's nothing that we can't work around. Y'all know we can figure any, just about anything out. This is not the worst lace I've ever had, but it's definitely not better than HD. So yeah, we're gonna have to do a little bit of finessing, but here what I'm doing is just trying the wig on and seeing if there's any cap that I need to cut off up underneath here. If the cap is above where I want the wig to sit, then it has to come off. And that's my rule. So I just like to place the wig where I know I'm going to sit it at. See if any cap is in front of it. If it is, then it has to come off. And it looks like we're pretty good on the cap. This is about where I'm going to sit the wig, I think. All right, here. The good thing about this unit though is that it fits like and not only does it fit but it's a little bit bigger so i don't have to be stretching the lace it literally will lay perfect on the sides i might have to cut a little bit in front of my ears but other than that like i love when the unit fits me or it's a little bit too big because it gives me something to work with so yeah we're good on this so now what we need to do is take this thing back off and what we're gonna do to try to match this white ass lace to my skin is I'm gonna put some powder all over this lace. I'm gonna put it up underneath the lace. I'm gonna put it um, in front of the lace. And basically it's just gonna change the color. It's just the fast way to tint your lace. So that's what I like to do. All right, so I'm done putting this makeup on the lace. Let's try it back on, see if it's matching. But before I do that, I'm gonna make sure this wig is gonna fit snug to my head. I just like to take these two elastic pieces on the back of the unit and cross them. And that just really make sure that my wig is gonna be super tight and it's gonna fit. Boom. So as y'all can see, uh oh, kind of messed up the part. But as y'all can see, right in front of the hairline, it's not white anymore. And that's exactly what we want. Um, this is really just like my little easy way of doing this. You could tint the hair, I mean tint the lace, but that just takes too long for me. And I'd rather just throw some makeup on it if I'm gonna be honest. Um, call it lazy, call it what you want, but it work. So I'm just gonna take a hot comb and go ahead and push this hair back and getting it ready to be glued down because you don't want any of that hair getting stuck in the glue because that's really annoying. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is clip this hair out of my way and then I'm gonna just flip this back. So, now what I'm gonna do is take my glue. I'm gonna be using Ghost Vine. I'm really running out of this stuff. I need to go get some more, but I'm gonna have to really get something up out of here today. So I'm gonna take a popsicle stick and I'm just gonna do about two layers of this stuff on my hair and um, you just wanna make sure that when you are spreading it that it's laying super flat, no clumps, and you will know that it's dry when it's white. I mean, not white, but clear. I just like 
to go in a little bit at a time. Um, it's just easier to work with that way instead of using like huge amounts at one time. I just like to go in and spread it out as I go because this stuff kind of dries fast. So if you like put a big clump on it and then you try to come back and smooth it out, it's not gonna be as smooth. So I just like to go in little by little and do it. And as y'all can see, it's spreading beautifully like butter. I love this glue. I didn't have so many people try to change my the glue that I use and I just really love it. Like it has never gave me any problems. I feel like I have got like maybe one or two bottles that were just like a bad quality. I don't know if like this glue has like an expiration or whatever. But like, I've only had like a few bad experiences with this glue. And when I say bad, I don't mean like it pulled out my hair or nothing like that. But like, I applied it and it didn't dry clear or something like that. So maybe it was like a malfunction with, you know, maybe like it expires. I honestly don't know. But other than those small experiences, I love this glue. Like, it's never too much did me wrong when it comes to a great install. So... I love it and I think I'm gonna always stick beside it because it's it's accessible it's at hair stores it's on Amazon like I don't have to order it I can really just go to my local beauty supply store and if I do have to order it it's coming fast through Amazon like so I'd be cool with it I love this glue. it don't break me out none of that it don't burn my skin none of that and I have very 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 sensitive skin so pretty much dry what I'm gonna do is just flip this lace back down and I'm gonna place it exactly where I want it to be but you got to be super duper careful I'm just gonna place it where I want it to be and you want to be super intentional about this y'all because placement is everything with your units and you want to make sure that you're placing it symmetrical on each side so you don't want like one side to be further down than the other because it's going to be noticeable when you do baby hairs or you push the hair back. Now I'm going to take my comb and just push it in to that glue, making sure everything is sticking. I'm about to cut some of this lace off, but not all of the lace. Just the part that is making it hard for me to see. So, just about this much. I see that? Okay. Now, let me get my elastic band. They actually sent me one with their brand on it. Super cute, but I'm just stretching it out. And then what I'm gonna do is take this Wonder Lace in the red can, and I'm gonna spray this all around the hairline, and then I'm gonna hurry up and tie it down. And that's gonna give that ultimate butter melt. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this hair out and while this lace is melting, I'm going to go through and press this hair out and just perfect the hairstyle. I really don't know what I wanna do. I think I wanna do straight, just like a bust down maybe. But since it already got layers in it, I think I'm gonna go through and cut some more layers. And yeah, cause I don't know what other hairstyle I wanna do. Let me see if I got some saved. Okay, so y'all. I think I'm gonna do side part straight with layers because since this is straight hair, I don't think that the curl is gonna hold very well. So this is what we're gonna do. Side part with layers. So I'm just making the side part now. It's kind of like a middle part because um, this is a 13 by four and you don't really get that much room to side part. So I like to go kind of towards the middle so I can get like a full part out of my side part. So technically this is like a schmittle, but it'll work. And I wanted to do like the, y'all have, have y'all seen like the bang? Um, 
the new trend with the side part with the bang. I want to do that, but I don't want to get in trouble with the company because sometimes they don't like when you cut the hair. So maybe after I do this and this video is over and done with, maybe I'll try the, the bang thing. Yeah, this is going to be cute. So now what I'm going to do before I press the hair out is go ahead and cut the layers in. I'm going to just take my scissors and just kind of go downward. Like that. And then I'm going to connect it as I go down. the bottom layer 30 inches that's why I didn't cut too much off the bottom but I just want to connect it going all the way down then I'm going to do the same thing on this side so I think I got my layers now it's time to go in and really press this hair out and make it look good I'm just gonna be using my wax stick and some hairspray in between to make everything lay flat So now I'm about to take this elastic band off of my head and so we can see what the lace is looking like. I might have tied it too tight. I might just have to cut it. Cause I don't feel like tussling with this thing. So. Boom, so I can already see I'm gonna have to fix this part. Let's go ahead and do that. baby hairs and I'm gonna do two swoops and two sideburns so let me zoom in let y'all see Let me know. 
this is what my hair looks like i done this baby hair over here and i think i'm just gonna keep the side ones I, I did this side one but i think i'm gonna keep this one just regular because i don't i don't feel like doing it so now what i'm about to do is put makeup on this part because it's not as bright and defined as i want it to be so i'm just gonna take a little bit of makeup and a little brush and then i'm about to fix the part okay i'm just about to use this concealer and this brush y'all this is my hair i'm about to do my makeup and i will see you guys in three two one so this is how my hair turned out super freaking cute i love it so much this color y'all already know this is my favorite 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 color on myself so i'm y'all not feeling it of course all the links on this hair will be listed in my description box as well as the coupon code so do not forget to go down there and uh, before we close out this video i'm gonna need you guys to give me a big old thumbs up and also comment down below and let me know what you guys want to see next. And also subscribe to my channel because my cash baby's lit. I'm lit and if you subscribe, then you lit too. And that's a what? That's a period. So yeah, y'all. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. <laughs>